Hey guys, what's going on? Quick shout out to my brother, Jason DeBono over at New View Trust. If you go to newviewtrust.com or just Google them um, and send them an email and tell them that you, you saw me put this in a video, I guarantee if you reach out to Jason, they'll send you like 20 of them. Good stress reliever. Money on my mind. <laughs> Anyways, um, wanted to hop in here today and share a little message with you guys. I'm sitting here and I'm like, man, you know what? I really feel compelled to share and give something, some type of message today, but I don't know what, like I'm, what have I learned the past, I don't know, 28, 48 hours that I can bring back here to you. And I thought about it, um, and I might've actually shared this one before, but I was listening to uh, an interview with Mark Victor Hansen, I believe that's his name, the author of Chicken Noodle Soup for the Soul. And um, he was being interviewed by Kyle Wilson, who's another very profound name. Make sure you look up both of those guys. Anyways, um, I'll never forget Mark Victor Hansen in that interview saying, um, that it's very important, well, he recommends that we all consider writing and creating our own uh, quote book and quoting ourselves. And I think Kyle asked him a question along the lines of, you know, how, how do you go about quoting yourself in the first place? That seems like a tough thing to do. And uh, I think Mark Victor Hansen's reply was somewhere along the lines of, um, well, you know what, all you really have to do is just start thinking profoundly. And by thinking profoundly and having the mindset that you are prepared to start thinking of quotes, to quote yourself, um, then they just start coming. So I'm sure something I just said, even in this video, I'm gonna go back and like, boom, that's, that's the quote, that's the Adam Carswell quote. So I wanna give that nugget, nugget of advice to you guys. If you haven't started journaling or writing, doing a quote book for yourself, definitely do it. I mean, you got nothing to lose and at the end of the day, you know, that could be a memory that could just create legacy just create legacy. You can pass it on through your family, friends, etc. Even when your time here is is all over. So <laughs> um, make sure if you guys are uh, tuned. Well, I'm not sure where I'm going to post this yet, but wherever I post it, subscribe to Dream Chasers. That's the podcast. I'm going to put a link to the, to the podcast there. That's my show. That's where I keep things moving all the time and always uh, bring you guys some next level nuggets. So thank you. Happy Saturday. You guys go have a good rest of the weekend.